also with us this morning, Attorney Jeff Anderson, who specializes in child sexual abuse cases and is currently representing some of Jerry Sandusky's alleged victims. Uh, good to have you with us this morning. These new details that are coming out, Armin, of course, speaking to McQuarrie there yesterday, and also the email that he just touched on that we learned about in which McQuarrie says he did, in fact, go to police. Um, how is that sitting with your victims? Well, these new revelations and Sandusky's denials really are causing for the survivors um, and these victims and their families really re-traumatization and re-victimization. I mean, they're really suffering uh, despair, confusion, and really fury uh, because Sandusky and those around him uh, remain uh, free to speak and deny and every time they do speak and deny, uh, they're really putting salt in the wounds. They're really putting a dagger in the heart. They're really um, uh, wounding the soul even further. And uh, in that way, we're really trying to work with these survivors to help them in their recovery, protect them, and let them know that uh, something can be done mm -hmm. uh, and will be done about well, what has been done. We are learning, as we just learned from, from Armin Katayan on the ground there, uh, he's being told more victims have come forward, more alleged victims, they are now being vetted. Um, have you been contacted by more alleged victims in the last couple of days? Yeah, yes, we have. We have been contacted by a number of families and uh, the victims' families, uh, all of them expressing uh, a desire to um, make uh, the truth known about what happened to them and their families, Ow. and in particular a desire, a courageous desire to make sure that other kids are not harmed mm -hmm. because in the final analysis what the victims and the survivors, courageous survivors we work with want, first is to be believed and second to make sure that other kids are not harmed. <laughs> The way they were and are, and in, in terms that's of that, why we're working so hard. In terms of that going forward, make, make sure that no child is harmed. There's been a lot of discussion about how this was handled uh, by the university. Uh, what do you feel the action should be uh, on a university level? Well, there's no question that it, there is here an institutional failure, a cover-up, if you will by uh, trusted authority figures throughout the institution. And what this institution has to do is take immediate action to speak the truth, take action to make sure that no further kids are harmed in the future, and to reach out to the survivors and to make sure no further harm is done to them, their privacy is respected, and action is taken by those at the top on down to make sure that they do not allow other kids to be hurt the mm -hmm. way so many kids have been by Sandusky and the institutional cover-up. Jeff Anderson, we appreciate your time this morning. Thank you. You're very welcome.